inspiration in a way for the fragrance for me has to do with women's sensuality. That kind of exotic fragrance that I've always loved. And I remember when I was working by the beach as a kid, there was all those different scents that just were mixing into one and concocting the fragrance in a way. That's what I was kind of uh, looking for. And I feel like we achieved that somehow. And it has that little masculine, feminine, obviously it's more feminine than masculine, but it's that ever sensuality, uh, sexy without hitting people over the head in a way to me. And I really wanted to use someone actually that I always felt was beautiful inside and out. And I know it's a little cliche to say it, but it has that feeling, you know, she's a real woman, she, she's beautiful, she's a mother, she's you know, professional also, she works, she does a lot of different things in life and, and I look at her today the way she is and even though I've known her for quite a while, she's as beautiful today that she was then. so sexy with a man shirt and I love the idea of her being a little more done that way. I find what we're talking about way more today. We decided to work with Michael Thompson who I've worked for I want to say maybe now 20 years. had only a sheet, white and simple, that she's using just to cover herself up. Even though there's minimal clothes and just lots of hair, there's a little, some, you know, bedroomy quality to it, it's still chic. And to me, Michael always gets that uh, feel. And it's just great to be able to collaborate with someone that, you know, you've worked with for a long time. Because you talk about the same things at the end. You know, he brings something, I bring something, uh, the model brings something, there's a makeup artist, and it's just that whole interaction that Michael is someone that listens to people. And there's something Small beautiful one. about that, Michael. Could you bring that into the center of her head? I, I just love the way he photographs women. I mean, he loves women, obviously, and in, you know, the way he relates to them, the way he loves to photograph them, I always love what he gets from them. Beautiful. But like this moments I love smiles and I love the touch in the hair. today and, and filmed her, it has that you know, kind of rawness with a little touch of sophistication. And you 
picture with the hair moving and it's just nothing that's already done it's just a little rawer version of that and so to me it feels like every woman could wear that kind of fragrance and whether you're sophisticated or not whether you're younger a little older not that i'm saying that you know everybody should wear it it's just that that universal feel to it that i really i'm excited about michael that picture is to me Back. I, I don't know, there's just something, it's just that one moment, is that gesture? He is interested, you know, and I think he's interested in the subject always is, that he's photographing, and I think you can see that in his pictures, and I, I'm just really grateful and, and thrilled that he could actually be available to do it and want to do it. Yeah, you, and I prefer the earlier ones. That's beautiful. I mean, to me, really, I mean, to me, me like favorite. when I see this, I just want to know I you feel are. The hair. You know, yeah. It feels rich. Yeah. It feels, but I love the whole. There's just something really sexy about it.